Hello my friends, it's me again, your favorite dentureware. I'm making this video on my phone because I don't want to deal with the cameras and everything else right now. But, there she sits. That's what I went and got today. Well, Saturday. You're seeing this video on Sunday. I had to park it in the yard because there's no tags on it. It's a uh, pretty doggone nice old van. It's a 93. And you can tell by looking at it, it's not all tore up. Interior's not bad either. It runs and drives. I had to do some work on it. I had to put a heater hose on it because it was just pouring water. And he thought the uh, water pump was bad. So I told him, I said, I think it's just a hose. And he was like, well, that'd be awesome if it's just a hose. Then you can fix it and drive it home. Well, I took the bike up there. So I was going to have to come home. I was going to have to come home with the bike. Leave the van up there. Have my brother take me up in the pickup tomorrow. And pick up the van. And they volunteered to bring the van down to me. That was awesome. Guy was like, uh, uh, Brad was like, hey, I'll just follow you. And my wife can follow me in the car and pick me up, and we'll just take the van to your house. Awesome. Thank you. That showed me that that van runs good and drives good and everything else. So, I'm very happy with the purchase. Very happy. Now, I got the van because I've got all winter to work on this buggy. I almost got in too big of a hurry. I almost borrowed my brother's truck and trailer and went and bought a little car. And then, again, I would need an engine puller and I need my oxyacetylene tanks and all of that to work on that buggy to do what I want to do with it. And I was getting ahead of myself. So the gentleman with the car will still have the car in another month. It'll still be there. I can almost guarantee it. Nobody's going to buy that car. The whole front end's gone off of it. Nobody's going to buy it. I mean, he took the fenders off and the hood off and the radiator out and everything else and power steering pump. But the engine and the drivetrain are still there, and that's what I need. So I'm not real worried about anybody buying it. It'll still be there when I'm ready for it. And if it's not, I'll find something else. But this way, I can just hook up the trailer to the van, go get it, bring it back down. And if I need to go get an engine hoist, I can go get an engine hoist. And if I need to go get propane, I mean, uh, yeah, if I need propane fill the propane tanks i can go do that if i need oxygen oxygen and acetylene tanks i can go do that i don't have to worry about putting my brother out by letting me borrow my borrow his truck all the time he's still making payments on this truck so i fully understand his if he's appreh apprehensive about it which i don't think he is he knows i'm a good driver i'm not going to wreck his truck he knows that but it's his truck, and I've been that way with my vehicles, too. I don't like anybody riding my bike. I don't like anybody driving my vehicles. So we're kind of the same way when it comes to that kind of stuff, you know. We're kind of the same on that. Um, you know, because you never know what's going to happen. It's not the person, you know, I would trust him to ride my bike or drive my van anytime. I'm not worried about him wrecking it. I'm worried about somebody else wrecking it. <laughs> Or wrecking him and he he's the same way he worries about you know it's not me he's not worried about me driving he's, he's worried about the idiot that's gonna sideswipe me or tail end me or cut out in front of me or something like that you know and it's his only vehicle so I get where he's coming from he hasn't said anything he, you know that he's apprehensive or anything but I can kind of see it in his eyes when I said you know I'd like to use your truck to go up to Idaho and get that car <laughs> I could see it in his eyes you know he, he wouldn't have denied me he would have said, yeah, go ahead. But I can tell because I am I have that same look in my eyes when, I, when somebody wants to borrow my stuff. So anyway, I've got the van. There she sits in the yard. Now what that is, is that's a 93, that's a 93 Ford van, 5.8 liter automatic overdrive. Um, three quarter ton. Heavy duty van. It's got three seats in the back, which I really don't need, but they're there. Might as well leave them. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm happy with the purchase. 
I'm real happy with it. It was cheap. Cheap. I'm talking cheap. Uh, I'm happy with it. And that's what matters. All right, my friends. I don't really have a heck of a lot else to say today. So I guess that's about it for now. Um, I hope everybody has an amazing day. Remember to keep smiling, keep trying. Whatever you do, never give up.